Welcome back to the Zone of Jamie. It must have been like a week and a half since I've done my last video. So I figured I'm going to do this sort of video. Uh, what's in my kit bag, my cricket kit bag, because a few people have asked on my vlogging channel, uh, could I do a kit bag video for my cricket? So uh, here it is. Um, this is my kit bag. I have a Slazenger bag. I don't know how old it is, I don't know what, what it is, but um, my uncle gave me it quite a while ago. The first item that's at the top of my kit bag is a long sleeve cricket shirt, a Slazenger one. Um, I think I've got this from like Sports Direct or something, and that's not a sponsor. Um, that one I just use for night matches, um, it's a little bit cooler. Um, on the sleeves, quite cool, I like that. Next item I have in the bag is a pair of cricket white soft trousers um, with a few grass stains. I actually have two pairs of trousers, and um, this is by far my favourite pair, but. Uh, I do with grass stains on them a lot easily because I'm quite a good fielder, so well, I'd say a good fielder. Next item in my bag is my um, club over pull thing, vest type thing. I'm not going to show what it is because I really want you to see um, certain sort of sponsors and whatever on it, but um, that is my over sort of top thing that I put on. It's quite nice, quite nice colours. Also inside my bag is another cricket shirt. This is a short sleeved one. Uh, yet yeah, again, the size of the one. This is obviously the Saturday matches, or it's just generally a little bit warmer. A keen part of my um, kit is cricket gloves. Um, I use these for batting. These, I think, these are sound as well. These are pretty old. I, know, I think it's like over 10 years old, but um, I just wear them anyway. I think like V800s. I don't know what it means, but uh, they do move all right. Um, they're a bit mucky. That's not on my muck. Um, like I said, these are pretty old. But there's nothing wearing new gloves if old gloves do the job anyway. Let's see that. Helmet. Now, in the past few seasons, I haven't really wore a helmet much, but this season I decided to wear a helmet um, for batting. Uh, I just, I don't know, I just decided to wear one more often. Um, and I quite like wearing it actually. It's an Albion one. Um, I don't know if that means anything to anyone, but I think it cost me like 40, 50 quid this, 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 this helmet. Um, not really, there is more expensive helmets. Some of the helmets are £100, like titanium ones, I think it is. So, that's my. Uh, that's my helmet. <laughs> but yeah, that's my helmet. Sorted. Um, that's messed my hair up, even though it was already messy. Next item in my bag, which is quite crucial for batting, oh, okay. is my cricket pads. I can't undo them. I should really have these tied up. These are Gunnar Moe pads. Uh, I don't know if I'm Gunnar Moe pads. I think I like 40 50 quid for them. Um, quite good. I like them. Is that one? I don't want to wear my white one. Yeah, it's weird that. Yeah, that'll be with my right leg because it's got more um, grass stains on or pitch stains. So, I, as you can tell, I can probably end up on my knee a lot because I sweep a lot. That's like my favourite shot. Um, probably set in one of my vlogs if you watch my vlogs, but that is um, a pair of cricket pads. I prefer having thicker straps. Um, so I had a pair of pads last season and they were all thin like this and they just don't stay on whereas thicker straps can stay on a little bit more. So that is my um, cricket pads. Next thing in the main part of my bag is my cricket boots. Um, I've had these for like, three, four years, just a standard pair of cheap sort of football and cricket boots. Just sort of fall out of them. From a sort of sports, um, I just, uh, I don't really need any new ones. These do the job, so that's how I see it. If it does its job, then why do you need to buy new ones? But yeah. Um, Pretty much essential for cricket, which you've got to slip around on the floor. What else have I got inside this main bit? I've got a plastic bag, putting stuff in. I've got a bag which I'm supposed to put my helmet in, but I don't. My helmet in. Um, bags which my pads would have gone in, no point taking out for the GM, just random nonsense. Bag. I think I have some really old wicket keeping gloves. I have a wicket keeper, I don't have wicket keep, but um, I think I've got these in here anyway. They're a bit. They're a bit, they're a bit yeah. They're a bit sticky. I don't know what that is. It's an inner sole of a shoe. I don't even know where the hell I got that from, but that is just weird. But yeah, they're just not very good with the tingles. They're all sticky. I think I might have to chuck them out soon. I also have a little pocket in the side. Um, deodorant. I actually put on before I play a match. Um, I don't know why I just like smelling good playing cricket. And obviously I put it on at the end. Sounds pretty random. Um, usually I have two or three bottles of water. Uh, that's from about a few weeks ago, so I probably need to that washed up, just water. Socks, 
um, usually I keep some socks in my bag. Um, sometimes I'm not wearing for too much in a row. It depends how dirty they are. They, they probably need to go to the wash, so I'll probably send them up afterwards. Um, cricket box. You, if you don't know, if you don't know what the sport cricket is, that is for men for protecting your private parts on your back because you don't want to take a ball in um, your gentleman's area. That won't be very good. Safe so yeah, for box. I know some people don't like showing boxes, so it's just a bit of plastic. I have. Cricket balls. Each season I've tried to start with three cricket balls that make them last me, like obviously just hit it around with random sort of throw downs and stuff. I've got four apparently now, so one of them isn't mine, but I don't know where that came from. Oh, found some else in my main bag, uh, main section of my bag. I found a hammer for knocking my bat in um, with a GoPro mount, which is very, very disgusting. It was a GoPro mount, don't work anymore, so that can't be going to be. Um, let's say I've got a hammer. It's not for a rubber hammer knocking your bat in. Just have it now just in case. Um, also I have my, I have this, um, it's a wrist strap for my left wrist because I struggle to bat a lot. Um, I hold my bat up with my left hand and that's just use it as a bit of a support thing. Um, I know people say you're not really supposed to wear supports so I'm trying to make things look bit stronger but um, I wear it just because it makes, I don't know, it, just, it makes sort of straight shots a little bit better even though I don't play many straight shots but that's just a little wrist strap thing that I have to support my wrist. Now, the main item of the bag, which I call it the main item, um, where people are sort of interested, is my bat. Now, in our house, we have, I think we have four, five, six bats. Um, this is my bat, and um, it is a Grey Nichols. Um, what's it called? A Grey Nichols Quantum Warrior. Um, I don't know if you can see that. I think I bought this originally for about £92. Pounds. Um, it's got a little bit of strapping on here, a little bit of strapping there, because when I when uh, let someone borrow it in the next one and they put a crack right down the back of the bat and you can't really see it on this camera but there is a slight little crack so we taped it and re oiled it and it, it works now it's alright but um, it's, it's quite nice really really sort of thickish edge um, if not that means in cricket terms you'll know what it means but yeah it is a short handle um, I don't know what they call it is it a grade one or a grade whatever handcrafted from grade grade A English willow the grey nickels um, Pre prepared by Grey Nichols, so that's my cricket bat. I'm just gonna do a. Could be very dangerous. Like a box. So, yeah, that is my uh, bat. That's been my cricket kit bag, what's well, in my kit bag video type thing. Um, I hope you've enjoyed it. I've made a right mess here now, so I'm gonna have to tidy it all up. Um, if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up, um, comment below, tell me what video you'd like to see next. Um, go check out all the social links below, go check out my vlogging channel, that's where you'll see a lot more sort of cricket footage and other stuff. Um, and I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, and remember stay tuned for more videos.